really hard to write well, and it never really gets easy. I don't know if that's good news or bad news. It <laughs> never really gets easy. Um, but I, I like to say, if you think it's easy, I think you're doing something wrong. And almost nobody starts out a good writer. Right? You, you decide to become a writer, even though your skills are not as good as they need to be in the beginning. But you have sort of a, it's an act of faith in yourself. You say to yourself, I really love this, I want to do this, and I'm gonna keep working at it until I get good. There's two parts to writing. There's the craft of writing. It's sort of the carpentry of writing, like how you construct a story, how you write dialogue. That's, that's a skill that you can learn. And if you begin writing, and this is why they say you should write every day if you can, that skill, you start to internalize it and it gets easier over time. And so for me, I've been doing this for 25 years, so the craft part I have down pretty well. But the other part of writing, the more important part of writing, is what I call the art. And that's who you are, what you have to say, what's inside your soul, your understanding of other people, your empathy for other people, your humanity. That part never gets easy. You're trying to access all of that and then translate it into a story. That's always, always going to be hard, and it's still very hard for me today. And that's why I don't care who you are, you, you can always fail. There's not a single filmmaker, director, writer, producer who can't still fail. Because what you're trying to do is so enormous that you'll never master it. Um, but that's also why it's a really interesting career. Because you're never going to just sit back and go, I got this. You're never going to be bored. You're always going to be fully engaged by what you're doing.